Hi everybody, Jacob here. Welcome back to my channel. I have been to the Chanel sales once more before they're over and I think they're going to be over uh, in less than a week or by the time you see this video I think they might even be completely over. So I've been letting my hair grow for a while and I've always my dream has been to get something from Chanel um, to go with that and now you're going to see this and you're going to laugh but it's I don't know, it's been years that I've been wanting something like this and I find it on sale. So to answer a couple of your guys' questions, again, do accessories go on sale? Yes, accessories do go on sale. And let's open this baby up, shall we? I'm extremely excited because, um, oh no, the flower fell off. Stick it back on. <laughs> um, I, this is going to be a really quick unboxing and a fun little tryout. Let's open this baby up, shall we? So what we get, flowers falling off everywhere. All right, so what we get is the new type of kind of rubberized looking box. When you open it up inside, what do we get? Get the little pouch and the Chanel marked logo paper to keep it soft so this little baby doesn't get damaged. We have the Chanel logo, you see this? It really collects dust, but it's very soft. And inside is this little baby here, hairpin <laughs> or hair clip. It's a very, very thick one, as you could see, made in uh, resin and it's handmade. So we have a piece of tweed in here. They have to really like layer them, put layers and layers and layers off and polish them, polish them, polish them to make them transparent. So this one has a lot of layers through them and it's hard to see maybe for you guys from here, but you could see the different graduations of thickness that these letters that spell out Chanel have. And I'm sticking something here. Um, so what is happening here is they have put by hand, you know, it's like a letter that, that you know, you would write like anonymous letter to somebody, you would put letters together to write a sentence. That's how Chanel was spelled in the Chanel font. And we have a blue tweed here. We have like the orange kind of purpley ready tweed as well, as well as like gold toned and metal snippets and papers and a lot of different materials used to create the Chanel spelling. This baby was made in France. You could see if you, you could see here if it would focus made in France. And then you also have your little authenticity stamp there that says made in France. Oh my God, it's so tiny. Uh, 15, spring, summer 15, made in France, copyright Chanel. So this is from the main spring, summer 15 uh, line. And basically you click it open. It's very simple like that. And then it bounces open and then you put it on your hair. Now you might think I'm crazy. I might think so too, but I'm loving this crazy, just like Android look of just attaching a little Chanel thing on the hair. Why did I, I waited quite some time to find the right one. They make them every season, like different sorts and stuff. Um, I mean, this shape with different branding or scenarios or landscapes within the resin. Um, this particular case, uh, I like this one so much because I'm a big fan of Pedro Almodovar. Uh, check him out. He's a great film director from Spain and uh, especially his 80s movies um, and early 90s movies. He makes the best intros to, to his movies. Like uh, he creates collages that move around and that's how he creates the titles and that's how he creates like the cast credits. It, it's really beautiful. It's like a short film within a film on its own. And this is very reminiscent of Pedro Almodovar. Pedro Almodovar also made a movie with a lot of Chanel in it. Check that out called High Heels or Tacones Lejanos in Spanish with Victoria Abril as the main actress wearing Chanel from head to toe, the entire movie. This movie was done in the early 90s. So that's the time of Chanel where Karl Lagerfeld did the, the best things for Chanel ever, in my personal opinion. This is very reminiscent of those times. So this little hairpin here, which you might consider a crazy thing, I love it, is very, very, very much so in the classic tradition of Chanel. We can also do a little Bam Bam look from the Flintstones. And wear it on top of the head. <laughs> but I don't know. We'll see. Or you could twist the hair and then clip it on like that. That's another option. Um, I've never seen anybody do this. So maybe I'm the first one. I don't know. 
Well, let me guys know what you think. This was just a quick little showcase of uh, this crazy purchase that I've been wanting to do for a long time, but never did. This is my only Chanel hair clip, uh, but it's like a lot, a lot, a lot of fun. I'm hitting something. Um, yeah. Anybody else into this sort of stuff? Let me know. <laughs> this one was also available instead of the blue uh, tweed, like red tweed. So there's a different variation. And they're also available as thinner versions. So if anybody still wants one and the sales are still going on, get your hands on one because they are reduced. Thank you guys so much for watching. Love you. Talk to you soon. Bye.